um, we decided that we would it, it, we were going to have to make the move anyway. We would move back down to Nashua, where most of our friends and our family are down in this area. And mm-hmm. after going through what we went through, we we found oh. that we really did want to be surrounded with our by our friends and family and closer to them. So yeah, so we're doing much better. I'm not going back in for a surgery. I don't want. Oh, no, it's misconstrued. You said going back to see the surgeon again. I don't want them. Yeah, it's not a surgery. It's just that he has some complication. It's it, it's kind of the graft is is shifting a little bit, and it's he's got more discomfort, and um, so we're just looking to see if there's anything that can be done for that. You know, the laundry was in the basement, and to get down to the basement, you had to kind of step down, and we were neither one of us was really capable of doing it any longer, and. Um, we were on the lake and the town is really kind of weird about things so renovations were not an option for us so okay. it kind of left us with no choice but to but to kind of look Make for somewhere else to live you know so as Karen said we just figured we'd kill two birds with one stone and that way we're getting closer to friends and family at the same time as relocating which was ultimately necessary anyway mm-hmm. It is difficult and it's hard to really explain why. In fact, that's that's one of the things we're still trying to work through is to try to find out why. I mean, you know, the obvious is the obvious. Uh, you, you know, people go, well, you know, and you were involved in this situation. We said, we understand that. But, you know, when you're waking up six months later and for all intents and purposes, there, it should be a good day and you're just having a bad day and you can't put your finger on why. You know, just emotions are, are much more difficult, and um, it's just, it's hard getting through. It's you're just, short-tempered, you're, you just, your relations are strained. Um, it's just different. There's a lot more loss than, uh, than people just really understand. Um, not just the loss of physical abilities or things like that, it's... Uh, you know, it's a loss of the joy of innocence. You know, that that belief that, you know, everything's good. And and to a degree, you, you lose some of that in this, you know. And relationships change, and it's hard. There's, there's more loss than people think of, mm-hmm. you know. And it's difficult. 